Hello there, pink ladies, pink ladies, pink ladies. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Hugs and kisses, kisses and hugs and blessings wherever you may be here on the YT. Once again, it's your girl, Pinky, and happy Thursday. <laughs> no, but seriously, happy Thursday. It is um July 11th, 2019, and your girl, Pinky, is getting ready to share with you some cuteness, some girliness, and y'all know I'm about that life. So let's go ahead and get into it. I have some things from the $1 holla from the 99 cents and up store. And I think one thing from uh, Ross, um, I went in there looking for something, but I couldn't find it. Then I was in a lot of pain, so forth and so forth. But let's get into it. So the first thing you see here, this cute little puppy with the shades on, honey, throwing no shade, but yes, throwing shade. It's as geek is the new chic. And I got these um, bags. I have two. That's why I said these. I got them from the um, 99 cents store. They are reusable bags. Really cute. So I had to grab them. I was like, okay, um, I would love to carry these around when I'm in the grocery store or in the store. Because here in Cali, yes, they do charge 10, 15, 20 cents for a bag. Um, so therefore, when I see cute reusable bags, I usually grab them. And these are very large for 99 cents. So these did come from the 99 cent store. So I'm going to stick those there. Yes, there's another one behind it. Let me show you. That's why I keep saying those and these and these and those. So I got that. And then next, everybody knows about the spicy noodle challenges and whatnot. But a lot of people order these noodles offline. Here in Cali at the 99 Cent and Up Store, you can find them for a dollar. And stay tuned, honey, because, um, yes, on this Thursday, I did do another challenge with some eggs and all of that. So y'all will be seeing me in front of the camera. You don't want to miss out because it is funny. Let me tell you, nose running hot, all of that good stuff. But um, I ended up finding this flavor I hadn't tried, which is the curry. So I ended up getting one of those. And then we got a repeat of this one here, you know, the black bag. And another repeat of the two times spicy hot chicken flavored ramen. And then last but not least, we found the mala, which I say hochi, 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 <laughs> hochi stir fry um, hot chicken flavored noodles. So we want to try these. I heard those curry ones and these mala are really hot. So, um... I will be trying those with the eggs in a video. I'm telling you, you don't want to miss it. Y'all know I'm already, I be acting up. Pinky loves having fun, so stay tuned for that. So I got those. And then I ended up finding these um cute straws. You know, I love pink, hence the name Pinky. You get 20 paper straws here, and they are like, um, and they are like, but they actually are pink and white. Um, they kind of remind me of like um, the boba straws that you get um, if you let guys have boba boba drink, boba teas, boba sm smoothies um, with the rice balls. Um, look like little gummy balls in the bottom of the cup. You can find them at like little um, tea shops or certain little places in the mall. That's kind of what these straws are like. So I was happy to find those for a dollar. And then stationery. I found these cute paper clips. I got two of them and um, it just has the lemon, an orange, a pineapple, a watermelon, a strawberry and a pear. So I grabbed two of those. I can use those all year round depending on, you know, how I'm going to do my decor. So I got that. And then I ended up getting these Disney, um, excuse me, fragrance lip glosses. And I found Ariel. Ah, sing! I love that movie. And then I have Belle. Um, this one is a strawberry flavored. Let me see. And Ariel is berry. And can y'all believe I have never seen this movie with a bell? I've heard so much about it. I'm gonna have to take the time to watch it, um, with my nieces probably and see what's going on with that. So I have that one. And then I have a Snow White here. Hi ho, hey, hi ho. It's um, then uh, uh, uh. So I got that one. Hi ho, hey, hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. And then I found a Winnie the Pooh here. <laughs> you know my very favorite characters from Winnie the Pooh is um Tigger and Eeyore. I love those two characters. So I grabbed those. And then the last two things that I got out of the 99 cent store were some erasers because um 
you know, you never know when you may need some. Plus, they are cute. Um, so, these here says fun shaped erasers. Let me turn it to the side. So, you get a purple, a blue, and a pink. And what I like about these, ladies and gents, they are very creative. It looks like a little roller you know like if you were doing like some painting or something like that so it's like you go back and forth and erase i said that's gonna be different and that's really cute and i love how cute the characters look and i love the outside packaging on these fun shaped erasers so i grabbed those for a dollar and last but not least from the brand num gnomes i got these 16 mini erasers it says we're scented sniff us so um smells so delicious okay so when i try these i'm i'm sure they're going to be different scents but they are super cute i love the cupcake and look at that little bunny i was like these are so adorable so i ended up grabbing those for one buckies and then next i went into the one dollar holla they're starting to put out um school stuff here um Summer school is ending or has ended and whatnot. So I've been seeing a lot of school stuff and I live for the school stationery because it's cute to me. But before I get into that, I'm going to share with you some glasses that I picked up. Um, I grabbed two of each. The first one here, I hope you can see that. It says Treasure Family. Then you spin it around here and it says Enjoy Friends. Spin it around again and it says Have Faith. Yes, hallelujah. Want to do it? I was like, All this positivity on one clear crystal glass. And it's not actually crystal, but you know, it is glass. So I was like, I love this. So I ended up just grabbing two. Normally I do a set of four, but in this instance, I ended up just grabbing two of that pattern. And then there was one more that caught my eye that looks like this. Same size, just different saying. It says kindness and laugh often. Or, well, here we go. Choose kindness. There we go. And laugh often. And y'all know I'm about that l positivity, loving life, having fun, laughing. <laughs> And being kind to one another is a big-ass plus for me, honey. So, I partake in that. So, I ended up getting two of each of those. And then next, let's go ahead and get into this school stuff. But first, I ended up getting this 48-piece um, puzzle. Now, um, a lot of you ladies have been following me for a while. But for those of you that's new to the sisterhood, let me share something with you on what your girl Pinky does. I normally find cute little pictures and things like this that just catches my eye. And once I put the puzzle together, whether I do it alley poo or I let my nieces and nephews, you know, just to give them some something, you know, creative to do and keep their mind going. Um... After I put it together, I will glue it and find a cute little frame and hang it on the wall somewhere. And I find, you know, cute little pictures like that. And I will put it in my cute little vanity or depending on the bedroom or um, picture how the style is. And then I'll go from there. So I grabbed this 48 piece because I thought these young ladies were absolutely adorable. I was like, look at her and look at those glasses. I love the like locks. Um, looks of the hairstyle kind of reminds me of Ali Pooh. I loved her heart shirt, her bandana, and the cute little pink rosy cheeks. I was just like super cute. So um, she got her shades. I was like, this is absolutely adorable. I would love to have that as a puzzle. So I ended up grabbing that. And then next, I ended up getting, let's see, no particular order. This this um, cute little um, jot. Is it by jot? Excuse me. Yes, it is. Composition book here with all the hearts on it. I just grabbed that. And then I grabbed some stickers by Jot. Um, both of them are 15 count. This one has the theme of a princess because we all are a princess and a queen in our own way, in our own right. Yes, we are. Let nobody dim your crown, ladies. You are a princess, honey, a queen. Aha! Uh -huh. And I love you, so I got to that one. Hey, that looks like Barbie. Look at that little Barbie figure. I just noticed that in that cute little mirror. So that's really cute. Um, and then I have these here. I was like, summer is almost over or practically over for a lot of us. <laughs> and I thought this was cute. I love the cotton that says happy day and the donut, of course, the little flip flops, you know. Um, the thing about us here in Cali, um, when it starts to be winter or fall for everyone else, um, 
it's usually still warm here for us and we're walking around still in shorts and we don't need the big heavy coats and things like that so I was like, let me still grab those. I can still use them and do something creative with them. And then I just grabbed this Sharpie here, which is like a um, hot pink for me to use and planners and um, other little things where I just want to leave a permanent marker. And then I found this movie here on DVD, The Houses, October Built. I think I saw this. Um, it was pretty scary, but at the same time kind of confusing. But for a dollar, I went ahead and grabbed it just to add to the collection and have it. And then I found these no-slip shoe liner um, socks. And I grabbed them because they were pink and I love the unicorn on them. So... I ended up getting those for a book at the Dollar Tree. And then I just grab these cute cards whenever I see them really cute and they're for a dollar. I send them out. They are birthday cards. And um, I thought this was so cute, the pink and gold. And in the front, it has fabulous, stunning, dazzling. And it has a cute little message on the inside and then something else of choice that I may want to add and write in. But I thought those were really cute. So I grabbed all the ones they had to just add to my collection for different birthdays that will be coming up soon. Um, let's see. I, I have something I can't wait to show you to the very end. I am so excited about. Then I ended up finding these lip balms by LOL and two by uh, My Little Pony. Um, this one here looks like this, but it says it's a surprise of flavor, so I don't know what I'm going to get. And then I have this one here. Um, I love the pink on that. Another surprise a flavor. So not for sure what I'm going to get. And then I grabbed the two My Little Ponies. One is in berry. One is in cotton candy. And they look like this here. Really cute packaging. Love that, love that, love that. And even if I don't use them, I do give them to my nieces. Because I have four nieces and one nephew. Um... So then I grabbed these um, large hand sanitizers, which will be good for your backpacks or just to keep on your desk or something like that. I have a pomegranate and vanilla, and then I have the cucumber melon. And um, I was like, hey, you can add and glue something here, an extra little charm, and make it even more cute and classy and creative if you choose so. So I grabbed that. And then next. Um, I ended up getting by Jot the pencil cases that looks like this. Love it with the ice cream, the watermelon, the hamburger, um, the hot dog. Really cute. So you get the decorative and then you just get the solid purple behind it. And then I found the pencil pouch that looks like this here. Love that. And then I ended up getting the composition book to match. I was telling Ali Poo and some of my other friends while we were laughing and shopping, when we was growing up, we didn't have all this cuteness. I was like, we just had the plain old, you know, little glue and um, Crayola little stuff. But it wasn't as cute to me. That, that's just my opinion. And then next I have the You Make It Rainbows with all the various rainbows and then it just has the um solid um, baby blue in the back these are pencil cases as well you get two i thought that's a, i think that is a good price for a dollar and then i have the composition book to match it says you make it rainbows grabbed that and then i ended up getting the two more pencil cases um with the boba on them i thought this was really cute as well and then you get the solid pink behind it and then I found the composition book to match that as well. I was so happy to find these things. And then I ended up getting the um, one with the rainbows and the clouds and the shades. And then it has a solid yellow behind it. Really cute. And I ended up finding the composition book to match it. Now here is something that I want to explain once again for all my beautiful ladies, grown and sexy, the kiddos, um, the youth, preteens, teens, um, 
And once again, us grown-ass women, it's okay to use all this cuteness, the girly stuff. Some people say, oh, that's so childish. It's so kitty. It's so babyish. No, it's not. If you know how to jazz it up and put the shit in your purse and make it look nice and you wearing it and represent it the right way, honey, there is nothing wrong with that. Excuse my profanity. But sometimes people, you just want to tell them, shut the hell up. They get on my nerves. You know, it's not like we walking around being kitty kitty. We can still be grown and sexy and have the cute y'all see it in my what's in my purse videos all the time and there is nothing wrong with it so keep on doing you if that's something you enjoy you represent it and you grab it and you go for it i'm all for the for the cuteness damn it i'm so sick of people in their damn mouth but anywho back to this dollar tree haul um and 99 cent haul i found these cute 15 um uh, mini scented erasers um and the first scent I got here is the watermelon, and it smells actually like watermelon. Really cute, so I got that one. And then I ended up getting the banana scented, and here's the top. And then I grabbed the strawberry. Strawberry, hey, and champagne, and these are really cute. And then I was like, and then if you have the kids or nieces and nephews, you might be a teacher or whatever. And it's still cuteness. You know, a lot of times you get the cute things and you do things it, it and you have things, excuse me. It makes the kids really want to get into it and use it and be creative and use things for their homework. So you can also be using that in a positive way. Um, so I grabbed the last one here, which is the pineapple. And then you can just see the pineapple shapes there. There you go. Really cute. So I ended up grabbing four cents. If there are more, your girl Pinky does not know about it, but that will still be good and enough for me. And then I end up grabbing two of the um, hand creams. I ended up getting the grapefruit with the sheep here. And then I ended up also getting the watermelon with the little mermaid fan. I think there is two other scents, but I could never find them. And I actually really just wanted this one. I think there was one that has a peach scent, which is my favorite scent, but I haven't been able to find that yet. And then I ended up getting these cute little essentials collapse, collapsible storage containers with the fur in the front. So I ended up getting these really cute and I grabbed four. I can use them for various things, um, storage bins, put them somewhere in the shed, can keep all my palms in there, can keep, you know, various socks, you know, and they're stackable. So I thought these were really cute. So I ended up grabbing four of those. Let's see, we're almost done. And then I grabbed these pins here by Ink Couture. And of course, they match the um, Jot um, composition books and whatnot. So I thought these were really cute. So you have the um, boba, you have the pizza, the foods, and then you have the sunshine. So I grabbed two because I figure, you know, once everybody starts their um, back to school shopping and whatnot, I will not be able to find those. So I was happy I grabbed that. And then last but not least, this was the bonus, the prize of it all. I was surprised to see this because we had been seeing it in Target and um, they were just too expensive and ended up finding one in the dollar tree <laughs> so it is this nickelodeon the splat now if you are a nickelodeon fan or if the kids are a nickel nick uh, excuse me nickelodeon fan you will definitely enjoy this i said i will color through it i will look through it but it has the rugrats it has hey arnold it has ren and stimpy um it has all these Rocco's Martin Life, um, and you know, um, Alexandria, well, as told by Ginger, um, my daughter Alexandria, Alexandria, oh my goodness, what I was trying to say and get out, you know, she was always into, you know, the 90s, well, she was born in 94, so of course she was into the 90s cartoons, so I couldn't help but watch with her look at this i was like this is cute to color or to find a black and white frame and just put it maybe in the kiddos room or if you just want to do something cute and creative and it says don't be a baby i just i thought this was really cute you got Susie carmichael chucky tommy phil and leo and i was like i'm loving this and then it just has all these other look at that Ren and Stimpy, and then these quotes and these sayings, and I was like, OMG, I am looking for at least 
four or six more of these to have. And I was like, these would be great gifts to make up great baskets, all sorts of things. Really, really cute. It says coloring the 90s. And um, here's the back of it. And then I was reading the back and it says it also has um, kicking it old school with the Ninja Turtles and SpongeBob, very grown up coloring. Um, I was like, I wish I can find all of these. I think that is so creative, so neat. And I was like, I looked up on this. I hadn't seen these anywhere. And it just so happened I was um, looking for some stickers and some other stuff. And it was all on the same aisle. And I found this. I even asked the cashier, are you sure this belongs in here? And when she scanned it, she was like, boop, $1. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> Holla at your girl. So that's everything that I got from the 99 cent store and a $1 holla. As always, I love all of you. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please be supportive. Do not skip those, add those commercials. Your girl is trying to grow. Um... And there's so much more I have coming, so many more laughs. I got some more What's in My Purse videos, um, some chit-chat. I will be in front of the camera soon. I have another noodle challenge with the eggs um, that I have done today on this Thursday, the 11th, honey. I got a lot, a lot that I will be uploading and sharing with you. So make sure you have on your pink notification. Make sure you um, check out the pink description box for all my social, other social media ladies because I would love to have you. I am a blast and so much fun. And um, I love sh sharing the laughter and love and fun with all of you. So thank you so much for watching. God bless you. Let nobody see your joy because they didn't give it. And I will talk to you sooner than later. Love you, pink ladies. Bye. God bless.